366 Days with Wisdom by Venerable Master Xingyun. November 7th Indigestible information and knowing too much may cause distress in life. Sometimes it is good to just stay dumb and deaf. Egoism and greed lead to suffering in life. Sometimes it is good to play the fool. There are no prescriptive methods of doing things in this world. In fact, we need to adapt to each situation with great fluidity. If one method does not work, then we should try another method. Do not cling obstinately to one's opinion and waste time on an insoluble or insignificant problem. The significance of stubbornness is magnified in the renowned traditional story of Mr. Fool wants to move the mountain. You are too stubborn as you cannot understand the situation well, is a popular line in the story. People who are too stubborn are often narrow-minded and traditional. They do not make friends easily, are very persistent with their views, and do not listen or accept good suggestions. Such people face difficulty in attaining success in their career and life because of an obstinate refusal to change. Being too unyielding is similar to walking with an awkward gait. If we do not lift up our back foot, how can we move forward? If we can release our unyielding manner, then we can have a brighter future. If we are always entangled by greed and hatred, coupled with egoism, desire, blame and intolerance, we will always be caught in a predicament, leading us to a lot of needless worry and distress. To free ourselves from these entanglements is simply to apply prajna, wisdom in Buddhism, and consideration to our daily life. Then we would enjoy the happiness of liberation. Read, reflect and act. Inflexibility is similar to walking unsystematically. If we do not lift up our last footstep, how can we move forward? If we can release our unyielding manner, then we can have a brighter future. Please tune in same time tomorrow as we meet on air.